Number one, believing that America was founded on racist ideals is wrong and incompatible with the judge's oath to uphold the Constitution. CRT proponents claim that America was founded and the Constitution was drafted to promote racism and slavery. His historians have debunked this claim as false. The truth is that America's founders were divided on this issue of slavery, and many of those were abolitionists. America's core ideals of freedom and equality, expressed in the Declaration of Independence and the Constitution, sparked the movements that led to the eventual elimination of both slavery and Jim Crow. CRT is sometimes erroneously analyzed, analogized to the civil rights movement, and some CRT proponents even assert that Dr. King was a critical race theorist, but he was not. Now, King would argue that Bull Connor, the head of the Birmingham, Alabama police, and the Southern racists were violating the principles of the American founding. But critical race theory would argue the opposite, that Connor was the fulfillment of the, of the American founding because America was founded to perpetuate this white supremacy. Ultimately, we cannot expect someone who subscribes to critical race theory to defend and protect the Constitution because CRT asserts that the Constitution is not worth defending. Such a view completely contradicts the oath every judge takes.